If your users want to check their Gmail messages in a third-party email client, first, you will need to allow that feature in the admin console, and then, the users need to enable it in their Gmail settings. As an admin, in your Google Admin Console at admin.google.com, go to the search box at the top. Enter the word IMAP, and from the search results, select POP and IMAP Access. And then, POP and IMAP Access again. Check Enable IMAP Access for all users, and then press Save. Once that feature is allowed in the admin console, you will need to go to gmail at mail.google.com. To enable it, go to Settings. And then see all settings. Click the Forwarding and Pop IMAP tab. After that, select Enable IMAP. We suggest you keeping the default additional settings. And finally, press Save. You'll find the values of the ports and servers to be used when configuring your Gmail account on your third-party email client in the table showing up on the screen. For additional details on how to configure it, search your email client's help center for instructions on setting up IMAP. When trying to sign in, you may see the errors, username and password not accepted, invalid credentials, or you are asked to enter your username and password over and over. To fix this, if the user has two-step verification on, they may need an app password. If two-step verification is off, less secure apps needs to be enabled. If two-step verification is enabled, you need to go to myaccount.google.com to create an app password. From there, go to Security in the left menu. Scroll down and you'll find the App Passwords option. You'll be asked to enter your password. After entering your password, you will see this menu. From the Select App field, select Mail. From the Select Device option, select the operating system of the device you'll be using the App Password on. If not listed, select Other. Then, you'll be asked to enter a name for the app password to easily recognize it. After that, click Generate. Copy the 16 digits password created and paste it in the password field on your email client while configuring it. Now, you should be able to log in without issues. If you have not configured two step verification and are having issues logging into your email client, you may need to allow the less secure apps. First, it needs to be enabled in the admin console, and then you need to turn it on in your user account. Go back to the admin console again at admin.google.com. Click the menu icon. Then go to Security, then Access and Data Control, and then Less Secure Apps. Select Allow Users to Manage Their Access to Less Secure Apps, and then click Save. Now, you need to enable the option on your user account. To do so, go to myaccount.google.com. Then select Security. After that, scroll down and go to Less Secure Apps Access. Then, just switch on the option Allow Less Secure Apps and try to log in again with your username and password. You should now be able to log in. You can also find the servers and ports, as well as more details, in the Check Gmail Through Other Email Platforms page in the Google Workspace Admin Help Center.